This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Tuesday, July 11th. Well, cruise travel is on the rise. Global Port Holdings, a cruise port operator of Nassau, Barcelona, and about two dozen other cruise ports around the world, projects a 45% increase in guest capacity to reach around 40 million cruisers by 2027. Now, this is just for their cruise ports. Now, over the past year, Global Port Holdings has already seen an impressive recovery with a 281% increase in guest numbers compared to last year's levels. In the first quarter of 23 alone, 2.5 million people passed through its terminals. And looking ahead, Global Port Holdings expects to welcome another 11.8 million passengers next year and trending up as the years go on. Some promising news there. And Carnival Cruise Line has made progress in upgrading its fleet, or some more ships in the fleet, I should say, with the Starlink Maritime Service, that really fast internet. Currently, 11 ships in Carnival's fleet have undergone the upgrade, providing guests with faster Wi-Fi speeds. They include the Excel-class ships, Mardi Gras and Carnival Celebration, also Elation, Magic, Pride, Panorama, Sunrise, Valor, Venezia, Sunshine and Vista all have Starlink and more to be added within the year. And Crystal Serenity, the first vessel to relaunch after being acquired by ANK Travel Group, has successfully finished its sea trials ahead of its inaugural cruise from Marseille, France on July 31st. The ship is currently undergoing its final refurbishment and finishing touches at Fincantieri Shipyard in Trieste, Italy. The cruise line also wanted to stress that the fire-resistant panels were checked and confirmed to be correctly certified and non-defective. And cruise line stocks were up on Monday. Carnival Corporation up 1.4%, 19.30. Royal Caribbean up 1.1%, 103.20. And Norwegian up 2.9%, 22.52. Breaking news and industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Cruise News Today is a production of Cruise Radio. Behind-the-scenes content and extras are now available at patreon.com slash cruiseradio.